Euralia, a prosperous land, home to many tribes. The gods entrusted the bird tribes to watch over the others. The tribe founded Pegaria, and all lived in harmony under the banner of the Pegarian Empire. Until seven years ago, when Pegaria began recruiting the dog and cat tribes. As their strength grew, the other tribes suffered. To protect themselves from Pegarian oppression, the scattered rodent and bear tribes formed an alliance, led by a rebel named Ratika. Tonight, the Pegarian Empire launches a brutal assault on the Rodentian capital under orders of Emperor Rindrick. When the capital falls, his conquest of Euralia will be complete. And far from the front lines, one who could have brought peace, the godless priestess Vera, has been murdered. In her absence, there is no one left to protect Euralia and its people. The end times are near. Euralia needs a savior. Emperor warned us about redemption sorcery. Kill the intruder, quick! But sir, that glow, that sword, is it the Harbinger? What? You think it's the end of the world? You see any floods? Any earthquakes? No, sir. But the elders, they say the Harbinger comes to prevent the end of the world, not cause it. Could be the Harbinger, or a retention sorcerer. I'm not taking any chances. This fighter is dead! Catch! Ludimir? You, you killed Ludimir? Your friend thought he could storm in and kill Emperor Injigal by himself. I can tell you this. He met the Emperor all right. And when he did, well, your friend's death was slow and painful. You're sick, just like your master. And where's your Emperor now, anyway, huh? Sacred to show up for battle? Oh, don't you worry. Indrik is coming. And he's more powerful now than you can ever imagine. But you will not get to bask in his light. For Odentia! What is that thing, sir? The retention to toying with dark magic. Attack! <laughs>
things right, sister. Indrek! I will smash your precious temple to bits if you don't come out! So we are all in danger. The threat. Do you know what it is? Did you investigate the godless priestess? That look in your eyes. You have never heard of the priestess. Mm. Where to begin? Ever since the first godless priestess appeared, the world has been a safer place. As if she scares the darkness away. But now the priestess is dead. Murdered? I am certain this is what has brought you here. Her murder is a sign of great danger. Ah, I only wish... I had more time... to help. I should have seen it. <laughs> Sooner. You there! What are you? Wait. Did you kill General Draga? Murderer! I'll have your head for this! has returned to devour the world. The Harbinger, awakened to fight this threat, learned of the godless priestess, of her role in protecting Euralia, and of her murder. But this was no simple murder. The immortal soul of the priestess always returns to the world. Always. But not this time. Vodun's return was planned. The world has ended, but there is yet a flicker of hope. Harbinger, focus on my voice. Let me help. So I can summon you here. Thank the gods. Do you know who I am? Then you did not inherit your predecessor's memories. We have no time to worry about that. Know that you are the Harbinger. You are the eyes of Euralia. You are its sword. And you are the only hope we have left. When Vodun is done devouring the world, he will find this place. No, he is already searching for it. 
And when he finds it, well, well, fighting Vodin is now impossible. Too strong. Even if you are victorious, there is not much of a world left to save. Harbinger, I brought you here for a reason. There is a way to save Euralia, but it will not be easy. I cannot force you to accept. But if you are willing, then come to me. Thank you, Harbinger. The Tree of Life. There is ancient power here, one that transcends the bonds of space and time. That power can send you into the past. You will have a chance to investigate the death of the godless priestess. If you find her soul, then the Tree of Life can spin it back to Euralia, and that may be enough to prevent Vodin from appearing in the first place. And we have a suspect, Emperor Indrik. You saw his war. There is no end to his ambition and cruelty. He may even be mad enough to unleash Vodin, and that means murdering the godless priestess and hiding her soul. The souls you bonded with, the tree can latch onto them, send you to the dawn of their last day. There is Ludomir who died at the hands of the Emperor. If you meet Ludomir before his death, if you follow him, you will find Indrik. Then there is Draga, who seems to understand the stakes. She may help your investigation in a way no one else can. Investigate the Emperor and the death of the Godless Priestess. Find her soul. But which lead will you follow? Draga or Ludomir? Make your choice. General, give me two battalions and I shall capture the core for you. I do not doubt it. But those battalions would turn the battlefield into a graveyard. For them and the Rodentians both. Iontrek's fury is the key for a swift victory. My lady is wise. But what if the fury fails us during the assault? Then we walk. Now, let us review the battle plan once more. Our main army will initiate a frontal assault. We will simultaneously hit the northern and eastern gates. When we do, Emperor Indrik will bring the Fury through the rear. Assuming we can trust the source. The Emperor secured the information personally. We will follow the Redentian's secret path through the Dead Forest into the heart of their city. We will seize the core and end their resistance. Intruder! I will protect you with my life, General. Stand down, Captain. If murder was her intent, she would have already struck. No. I've read of this figure. The Harbinger. Harbinger. Why do you grace us with your presence? Something must have happened. And you think I can help you? It can't be the war. 
Must be something spiritual. The murder of the godless priestess. General Dragon! The prison! Riots! Now? Ah, oh, Radica, is that your move? Of course it is. I expect no less from the Rodentian leader. You must have a plan to stop us, and I cannot allow that. And you, Harbinger. A favor given is a favor repaid. Help me with this, and I shall aid you in any way I can. I brought something much better. Together, yes? losses, even to rescue a leader. No. This is a kelp... ...calculated sacrifice. They must believe Radica is a game-changer. with your sword. So, Harbinger, is it really the death of the priestess that has brought you to me? I will do my best to help you. Vera was... She was deeply respected. I would hate to stand by and see the murderer go unpunished. waiting for us to charge headlong. Let us first level the playing field. Incoming! Your sword 
seems unwilling to harm allies. Prisoners are writing insults in ancient Hungarian. Who taught them? Ah, such filthy language. And the spelling is all wrong. Together, yes? Harbinger. Your uprising almost impressed me. Almost. Now, lower your weapons. Ratika is not worth dying for. High and mighty, General Draga. Tell me, General, how do you sleep at night knowing everything your Emperor has done? Or do you enjoy the killing and the torture? I am loyal to Emperor Indrik. Surrender and give me Ratika. Now. Not a chance. Follow me. I have a plan. They do not know about this path. Yes, General. There is a rumor about the priestess. Some soldiers say that she was sniffing around Yarbor's temple not long before her death. A rumor goes as far as claiming that she has been caught inside the Emperor's ancestral crypt. <laughs> Nonsense. The crypt is protected by an unbreachable seal. We need to go.
I've been thinking. Vera was a fierce advocate for peace with Rodentia, even met with Ratica and her people. Caused quite a diplomatic stir. Perhaps Radica can tell you more, if she's in an honest mood. Where did you go, little mouse? I was hoping to end the war with minimal bloodshed. No doubt Radica has slipped away to the forest and joined the enemy forces. Come. It seems we will face her on the battlefield. Iontrex Fury is up ahead. The Emperor will use it to end the Rodentian Revolt, and I must assist His Highness. Sign of his highness, my lady. What shall we do, General? Call off the attack? It may be our last chance to strike. Soldiers of Pegaria! Our Emperor has placed his faith in us! He believes in our victory. Victory for Pegaria! We are one voice, one nation, one destiny! Pegaria! We march! No! At least the secret is in safe hands. Now, welcome aboard the Fury.
Harbinger collect amber. I expect the respite to be brief. We are not alone. A fool. I should have seen this. And push. The Amber Core. I would have expected Rataka to make us stand here.
soldiers. Victory is at hand! Is something wrong with your sword? Something is wrong. Ratika? I am deathless. I am your end. Will you break or will you bend? Deathless? Have you connected with the void? Stay sharp! She's a slippery one! like I only know part of the plan. We have seized the heart of Rodentia. The Amber Core is ours. The enemy army is broken, their leader dead. Deathless. Such a terrible thing to do. Ratika opened a link with the Void. Becoming deathless unhinges your physical and mental limits, but at the cost of your emotions. Perhaps this is what it means to lose your soul. Or perhaps becoming deathless strips your soul of artifice, revealing your true nature. Who knows? We owe this victory to you. I will ask the Emperor to help you find what you seek when he arrives. I wonder what kept His Highness to not march with his army. It is unlike him. What could b by the gods? Once again, the giant snake Vodin, avatar of the great void, surges forth to devour the world. The chain of events triggered by the death of the godless priestess have played out as they have before. The truth must be found, and Vodin must be stopped.